Hey guys, so today I'm going to be filming a video very impulsively. It's like 12.30 at night, past midnight. I'm super tired. I'm going to show y'all the school supplies that I'm going to bring to college my freshman year. Normally people will do like a dorm haul and they'll show you all the stuff that they got for their dorm their first year. But here I am with everything that is going to my dorm, either scattered throughout my room or it's in this one big box in the kitchen. First things first, I got a backpack. I got a new backpack this year. I got the Lululemon everyday backpack, I think. I don't know, but it's super nice. It has, it's waterproof, which is really important because my campus can get really rainy. And laptop slip, which it is a little noisy, which is kind of annoying, but. And then I have this front, pocket or well, the big pocket that can hold you know stuff in the back like that I don't know if you can see it's hard to tell because it's all black pockets in the back and then this little like slip on the front and then I have this front pocket which you can keep stuff in it it's one big pocket I thought it was two pockets it's one big pocket um and then I also got a new water bottle because if you don't know, I have my one pink water cup and then I have this big white water bottle, which is huge. I have to go and find it because I'm going to take it with me to college, but it will not fit in my sleeve and it's not like extendable. So that is one thing to know about Lululemon backpacks is that if you carry around a big water bottle, you will be carrying it around. But this one's narrow and it's, I think it's the same amount of water than my other one carried actually it's definitely not but it's way more than this so actually maybe not this is a 20 ounce oh and this is a 24 ounce so yeah this carries more water and that's all i need because i won't be in my classes for as long as a full school day like i was in high school that's my new backpack and then carry on with things that aren't like school supplies i got new airpods and a new airpod case i got the well, I really hope my I really hope this didn't connect to the stupid speakers, but I got the series three because I have the original like very first generation AirPods that were ever put out back in like 2018 or whenever. Um, so I got them. I got a cute case for them because my old AirPods I never put a case on them. I just got like a wrap from Bath and Body Works that they put on their hand sanitizers and I put it on there. But I actually got a cute little case and the color is so pretty and I love it. I'm so excited to use these. I got these because I'm going to be walking around campus. Now getting into the fun little school supplies I got. Okay, so most of it's from Amazon. First things first, my oh so amazing planner. I used to have a blue sky small planner for 2020 but it did not work out it was too small i never used it so i got a bigger one which i got a big girl planner i got a big girl planner i love it tying into my planner i also got myself stickers so exciting um they're gonna be cute they're supposed to be cute aesthetic stickers for my planner um supposed to have a lot of different stuff a lot of different themes for holidays and fun 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 stuff so i'm super excited to you know make it all exciting and cute speaking of exciting and cute here's my pin bag um it is also from amazon and it is huge it's supposed to keep a lot of stuff apparently there's a front pocket there's this whole zipper spot it keeps your very first things of pencils and pens right there and then you open it up and there is even more space this is probably going to be for all my midliners i have a lot which i will show you in a second and the honestly show stopping thing is that it's a second zipper what is the second zipper for to have more room like a suitcase like a suitcase it's awesome and i'm so excited to use this for all of my pens and pencils this next year i was originally going to get it in green sage green so cute but um that was not going to ship for a very long time so we got pink and then oh my god 
they just all fell out of the cup but i have all of my bin liners every color ever made um i was going to get a new pack of bin well i wasn't going to get a new pack of bin liners i knew i had these and i actually have a pack that i would take to high school with me but since i'm going to be on my own schedule on my own time i am going to keep my all of my nice ones i would keep at home i'm gonna go and take them into my bag with me and then these are all my micron and whatever brand these are uniball and yeah these are just all my really nice pens i've always kept on my desk but i'm gonna sort through them and i'm probably gonna take my micron like normal black ones in my pen bag because i was going to buy a new pack of micron pens but why would i do that when i have perfectly good ones right here that were my at-home pins and my school pins ran dry i use them for all my notes and they do not work anymore so i can't use those but that's fine and then i have new mechanical pencils because these break after a year but they are my tried and true go-to i love them my handwriting has never been better than in these so always get those and then super excited i have these moji notebooks I got like a huge pack because that's all that would ship in time. And these only have 30 sheets. So I will be trying and attempting to write front and back notes in these. And luckily I only have semester long classes and hopefully some of my classes aren't that heavy in notes. So this should be fine. We'll see. I also got these because they're smaller and they're lighter and I can put more of them in this backpack without my back giving out, which was a huge issue I had in high school. I also have these five star notebooks. They're one subject and I actually bought like four of them that were like plain colored. But then on top of that, I really wanted the these nice aesthetic recycled ones from Amazon, but they were out of stock when I went to order them. And lo and behold, I checked yesterday and they were back in stock after I had already bought regular spiral notebooks. So I am going to be getting though i will just have a lot of spare notebooks laying around that i will use for next semester and the semesters after that oh i also got a new pack of pins um it's this pin but for some reason it's in black it's the same oh it's the same um 07 so i don't actually really see a difference in these um but these are so good if you like to journal at night love them even note taking they're good but you do have to let them dry Microns, you never need to let them dry. You can always just highlight away. And then I got a new journal, obviously, because I am running really low on my current journal. I only have like five pages left in those. So I got a hardcover version of an old notebook that I used to have. Um, I always get, I never know how to pronounce that, moleskin, moleskin, moleskin. Um, I always get this brand for journals and I have two of them already, a tan one and a green one, just this color, but they're both in the paperback cover. So I decided to spring for the hardcover one because I don't know, something about the paperback ones, they're so hard to write on if I'm not at a desk and half the time I'm not journaling at a desk. So trying something new. And then I have some folders and some tape. I'm only going to use one folder though. That's my superpower is that I can fit everything I will ever need in one folder. And I also probably won't be getting that many hand handouts. Now before all you current college people come in and say, all I need is a MacBook or all I need is a computer, all I need is an iPad, you're probably right. Like I know that you're probably right. Like I get it, but there's just something for me about paper and pen that helps me learn like i cannot learn by typing stuff onto my macbook i can only learn by writing stuff down on paper so that is my own personal i will get that figured out but until then i'm going to keep writing my notes and then i got tape because i always use tape i use tape in my journal i use tape in my journal i just use tape a lot in my opinion and then the only few things i actually have here for my dorm that is not packed away somewhere is well this is not for my dorm either but this is for my macbook it is a usb-c hub it has sd card reader a usb cords or ports an hdmi port which is super important so yeah uh if you don't know a macbook pro only comes with two usb-c ports so i cannot really do much with my computer other than that 
so I will luckily have this little hub. And then I got these curtain string lights, which is actually really funny because I was a manager for my dance team back in high school, my senior year. And we had a spring show and we were putting up these lights along the auditorium and I thought that they looked so pretty. I grabbed a box, I took a picture and I found them on Amazon and I ordered them for my door. <laughs> that is it. Unless you wanna see very expensive little Build-A-Bear. My stepsister and I made matching build -A -Bear. Actually, I'm gonna cut that out. Um, nobody else will ever get to hear the message she left for me and nobody else will get to hear the message I left for her. So we got matching Build-A-Bears except hers has like a clear glasses and mine has these shades because she's cool. But look, it's cute little bunny slippers. I don't know. I am so excited to take her to college with me. But I'm also taking my plants. I'm taking not, I'm not taking all my books. Sorry. I did get a brand new bookshelf just for college though. And I thought that it was gonna be like this size of my nightstand, which is like yay tall. It's yay tall and whatever. It's still tiny enough that it will fit. I have the space for it. It's just, it was way taller than I thought it was gonna be, which is actually really good. So I won't have to like take books home as often as I thought I would have. That is all the exciting stuff I have for college to show y'all. I might do a dorm tour. I might not. I don't know yet. And not to mention, this is not all the school supplies that I'm going to bring. I have this huge tub of school supplies that I've used for my desk. And in that tub, I have sticky notes. I have lead, erasers, all those fun things that I... I am stocked up on that stuff. I'm not even gonna try and buy new stuff for that because I have it. I have years of back to school shopping sitting in that box. So I'll be using that. But yeah, that is all for today's video and I hope you enjoyed a little stationary haul. You know, I always do. I love a good stationary haul and I'm super excited to start a new year.